Hey y'all, thanks for stopping in. Appreciate you taking time out of y'all's busy schedule, stop in and see what it is I'm up to. Like the title says, it's a Kirby haul. Um, you know, I was out, I had to take the Grand Brats home today and on the way back from there, there was a pile of stuff and I can't, uh, I can't not stop. But anyway, um, bring it down here. First of all, let me give you a quick overview. I'm guessing the person or persons was a Dale Earnhardt fan, which is, I'm a Dale Earnhardt fan, or I was. Anyway, um, some of these packages aren't in the best of condition, but I think I may try putting some of this stuff on Swip Swap, maybe just put a, put the whole bag up there. This says mushroom soup kind of a cool bowl Dale Jr. Bud car I haven't opened this one yet yeah man there is a Dale Jr. race car now I've checked, the batteries are not corroded, but I don't have any power, and I cannot get this little switch to move. So I don't know if this thing works or not. Going down here a little bit. Ooh, sun. There is a Dale Jr. Nation flag. Um, it needs to be washed. I'll see how that turns out. There are a couple of car window type flags that are, have seen better days, but um, they are, it is what it is. Again, this box is not not in the best condition, but I can take the stuff out of it that's inside. This is a Dale Jr. figurine. And then this ice chest. It's not too bad. Needs to be washed out. Soaked out with bleach or whatever. But I think somebody's trying to tell me something because this big old somehow I turned the camera off when I grabbed it but that's okay I switched views this uh, big old thing I don't know packing crate or something it's got quarter inch plywood down here and then uh, Reinforced there may have been part of a wall. I don't know um, It is Fairly long How long you may ask well it starts at that end and it goes to that end So I'm supposing that it's about it's About that long <laughs> No, actually it's just a little over eight feet. It's eight feet from here to here so maybe eight feet four inches or something on the two by fours now i know i was going to make a bed out of pvc for pipe and i was a little concerned that even two inch would kind of bend but then i found this and to really like sweeten the deal this was all there too couple of large lag bolts a bunch of screws and 
Well, it's going to be a bit heavier than what I intended, but then I'm a bit heavier than I intended. <laughs> uh, a Ronson Wind 2 lighter. I don't usually carry this type of a lighter. It at least needs a flint. 22. Any other one? No? Okay. Oh well. Uh, there were no handguns. Drat it. But I'm going to have to weed this, or weave this one together, I guess. So hopefully I'm not. I don't have you all being blinded. Anyway, let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs down or a thumbs up. Leave me a comment wherever it is. You all leave comments on your internet access device of choice. If you'd like to share me around on your social media, that would be fandoculous. Uh, if you'd like to check out my Facebook, uh, the link will be down in the description. Uh, wherever that is on your device. Along with uh, links to similar videos that I've done. You'll also find my snail mail address if you'd like to send me some snail mail. Um, if your loved ones are nearby give them a kiss and a hug if they're not give them a call hit them up on Facebook let them know you're thinking about them let them know you love them you never know when the last time you get to say that's going to be the last time you get to say it don't regret not saying it Mother Nature has a tendency of throwing a monkey wrench into our lives whether it be the big storm coming into the northeast of the United States right now, or if you're at work and drop a 10 pound hammer on your foot and break your foot and you can't go to work for a week. Um, you never really know. Until I see you all again, I hope you have a fandoculous day. Uh, I think I'm gonna put a slideshow of some of these things at the, at the end of this. So, um, if you wanna watch, go ahead. Until then. Slaunchy, y'all. Bye-bye.